Uh, hello guys, um, welcome to this episode of uh, Spencer Science, uh, it's been a while since I've done this, and um, yeah, so I'm, I'm back though, I'm back for today, uh, while I don't have school, because it's a Saturday, I, uh, I thought, you know what, you know what, I am... Um, I'm gonna get into a video. And so, uh, here's the thing. So, I, so there's this thing in, um, there's this thing in What If, and it's called Absolute Points. And I just, you know, I just wanna talk about it for, for like a minute. Because here's the thing. In, in real life, can there actually, so in Marvel's What If, there is this thing called absolute points. They kind of introduced it, and it's this whole entire idea that there's just one big change, and that change is absolute. It will it will happen in uh, multiple realities, never change, and will stay the same. So, um, so today I'm going to be answering if that is also equivalent to real life. So imagine this. This is a straight line. I mean, this is well. This is a lightsaber. But imagine this is a straight line. This is a straight line through realities. Uh, and assuming in our world that there are a, that there is a multiverse, assuming that there's different could be different versions of us, um, this straight line can can show all all sorts of realities of different versions. Of us but there's one particular thing one one particular or m perhaps multiple events in each reality that change everything there is just that one one thing and and that will be the case in all realities it's so big that I mean it has no choice but to keep along this steady line and to for that change to, to happen in multiple different universes. So you know we have this line and it just it will stay the same consistently. No no single change. And and here's why this could be true. So for for like I think I think as long as I could remember I I was starting to think of the idea of time and sci scientists just in general having the idea that there's multiple universes around us somewhere in space between different worlds and that different worlds um, of course something we have not explored but I mean is that a thing and some say yes and I could lead to that. I can I can understand that. And so if, if that if that is the case, then um, then yes, maybe there's personalities and people that change, and we change in different realities. But there's but when you think about it, there could be one or multiple events that is so big that makes such a ch change and makes such an impact that it goes throughout realities. It, a death, anything, like a death of, yeah, so like a death of a person, um, a president becoming an office. I mean, it, it could be, it could be anything. I mean, in what ifs case, Marvel's what ifs, that it's Tony Stark. I mean, that's almost like an absolute point that cannot change and stuff like that. Um, so, like, for us though, what if the absolute point is that Barack Obama eventually becomes president? It might be in a different time stance. It might be a, it might take a while. But but what if it's? But could there be an absolute point that was such a big change and such a big moment in history that it just has to happen? There is. The, what words? I mean, just when you think of it as a straight line, it just it goes 
throughout through through the line of realities that will that that big change will last throughout every reality every world and I mean change everything like um, say um, uh, this is a random one uh, say you uh, it fail on a test, right? That's that's not going to be a, an absolute point if we're speaking about uh, down to earth, because well, you get different grades. That's and we, and if it's different versions of us, then it's different uh, different personalities, perhaps maybe the same idea, but it's pers different personalities, different person altogether by mood and expression. Um, so, point is though, this idea, this idea of absolute points could make sense. I mean, there, there could, in our timeline, through the different realities, be, be a big change. And, and, and who knows what reality is in the center of all that. That, that could be decided by, by anything, right? That could be decided by anything. But... Um, it, it's a change that just stays the same throughout all different worlds. No, no matter what, what change that comes from, it will just not change. It will stay the same. And is that the way that reality works? I mean, maybe. Uh, re reality could have uh, our space and time is something we know very little of. And so maybe, I mean... We have, we already have stars, constellations in space. We have novas. We have, uh, we have asteroids. We have, I mean, I'm the stars. I've said, uh, planets, worlds, unexplored, and and so that could also lead into absolute points. I mean, we and we have the idea of speed of light. Too. And, and so, w w between all of that, and between everything, it's possible to see that absolute points are a thing that just happen, not, not inside the TV show, not just there, but inside the broader picture of our world and other people's worlds. Um, so... Yeah, with absolute points, it could be anything, and it could, it could be anything, or it could be everything, and th that big change, like, like I said, it's probably more particular to famous people, uh, deaths and like deaths and wars. Wars are probably a big one, and everything. Just something that can go throughout history, and maybe, just maybe, that's an absolute point of. All reality no matter what their timeline is no matter where they are and what we are at that point um, it will always be the same the absolute points once a big change happens it could could perhaps go throughout time and so there you have it ah, absolute points in reality um, and uh, I'll see you guys whenever. Okay, so, see you.